Hello everyone, welcome back to another video from Techie Pocket. And today we're here with the monthly build, the $20,000 build, which includes a keyboard, a mouse, three monitors, and you know what. So let's begin with the CPU, the 6950X Extreme Edition 10 core processor, which no one didn't expect. Corsair H100i V2 CPU liquid cooler, though you could go with a what's it called a custom loop I decided not to go with that instead put it into the three monitors that are crazy okay the motherboard then is an Asus Rampage 5 edition which I do believe there's a, a higher edition but I'm not sure then I went with G skill rip Jaws series 128 gigabytes of their 8x16 kit DDR4 3000 megahertz memory that should be fine two two terabyte Samsung SDDs and a uh, one terabyte, I mean, 10 terabyte HDD for your permanent storage. Then I go in with two Titan X Pascals, which everyone expected, obviously, and the Inwin H Tower, which is the coolest tower I've ever seen. If you haven't seen this, you can go ahead and search and you'll see it's the coolest cat tower. If there is a tower cooler than this one, which I can almost guarantee there isn't, then please comment down below. After this is the Corsair 1500 watt 80 plus titanium certified power supply because this thing takes I believe 991 watts which is incredible. I put in this uh, operating system disk here but I do recommend getting it from Kingwin where you can put it on a flash drive and then install it that way and it only takes like half an hour versus with these disks it takes like all day. Then this is where I had to put in the real investment, $5,000 each for three monitors, 31 inches, and they're 4K, so this is incredible, and the only way to do this is with two Titan X Pascals. Then we went with the Corsair Strafe RGB wired gaming keyboard and the Razer Naga Star Wars Edition wireless optical mouse. Now of course the mouse and keyboard you guys can pick because Everyone has their choices. I personally think this is a good keyboard and this is a good mouse, but for you it'll be different. So as in total, this came out to be $21,832, which is $2,000 off the budget, but that should be fine. So if you guys enjoyed this build, make sure to give it a like and subscribe. And if you didn't enjoy it, make sure to dislike it. Either way, tell me your opinions down below. And also, I recent I just opened a new part in my website, yttechie.cf, so make sure you click the link down below to check that out. Catch you guys in the next video. Bye.